we go. Second cup <laughs> dance for you on this Thursday. Welcome to Friday Eve, everybody. We're Friday gonna, Eve, I like that. Change we're going to celebrate because tomorrow is Friday the 13th mm -hmm. with a full moon. With a full moon. Good Creepy luck, stuff. everybody. I'm staying at home. Supposedly not going to happen again until 2049, so we'll see. Yeah. That's creepy. We're going to see how things turn out for Brazil. I know. I have all eyes on Brazil right now. Yeah, 4 o'clock today, our time, 5 o'clock their time, uh, it's going to be Brazil versus Croatia to kick off the whole World Cup. But, of course, uh, you know, just a lot of questions as far as not whether or not they're ready. Mm -hmm. But a lot of training to go into. A lot of fans are ready. The teams are ready. We, of course, got a tier, cheer for Team USA. USA. We got a flag here for it and everything. USA. Here they are training for the games. Now, fans around the world say they've spent the last few weeks actually getting prepped. The U.S. national team, first game Monday, June 16th against Ghana. Kickoff, 6 o'clock Eastern time. Good. Old glory right here. By the way, Flag Day coming up this week. Exactly. Too. Lots oh. of patriotism. So get your red, white, and blue. We have yeah. one of the colors. Yeah. So So I missed yesterday's morning show, mm -hmm. but I heard that I missed out some hardcore you fans. You missed. We ha like, these were Team USA super fans. I mean, literally head to toe, shoes, socks. They apparently have wigs, As scarves, big as Star Wars pants. fans when we had them on? Seriously, here's some video of them. Wow. Uh, these are just, this is just some of the stuff that they have. They have patriotic duct tape. They have T-shirts. They have those American flags. That's one of them. It's been signed. I had to get another soccer ball action. Um, they wear the American flags as capes. You can see they have the official jerseys. He apparently like shaves his head with stars and stripes and puts paint on it. He made this Captain America shield. He, I mean, these they love it. And it was Megan and Cody. So I love how pumped they are. And it's year round. They travel all around to wow. see Team USA. So this is truly an exciting time for them. You know what I watch for? Cup. I watch for the announcers. Yeah. No announcers in sporting get as excited. No. What was that thing that the the people had? Remember, it was like really the loud. That's what. Those got so annoying after a while, though. It was fun for like the first day that they had those, and then kind of like this, it just keeps going. <laughs> Man. Yeah. Well, this is pretty cool, too. So we were saying, you know, people all around the world getting mm -hmm. ready for this. People out of this world getting ready for it, too. Check out video here, International Space Station. Even showing the rise in ah. temperature as we get closer and closer to these games. Look at this. The, the competition's on, floating around in space, getting ready, doing a little bit of their practice here. U.S. astronauts Reed Wiseman and Steve Swanson and German astronaut Alexander Gerst cheering on their teams about 230 miles above Earth. Uh, I guess kicking the ball around <laughs> takes on. I feel like I there. can handle soccer like that. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I mean, I look at, oh. <laughs> Say. But see, the ball doesn't travel as fast. So That's you true, but it is But harder. you don't travel as fast It's either. harder to get hurt, though. Because, you know, you're going to dive for it, and yeah. you're not going to, like, fall and hit the ground. Ping in is something there. And right. And you know the International Space Station's flown off. I always played uh, defense and goalie. I didn't play soccer. I thought you were, Sorry. like, a big soccer fan. <laughs> no. Man. Well, do you know there's I don't also know anything a about World soccer. Cup? I'm going to learn. Oracle? Of course there is. There's a World Cup everything. Yeah. We need World Cup cups. Oh, that would be awesome. Someone get on that for us, please. Station cups, too. Well, <laughs> Apparently, a 27-year-old male sea turtle, he's now a local star in Brazil, huh. for his ability to seal faith. He was given the choice of eating a fish hanging from the Brazilian flag or one from a Croatian flag. Oh, which one did he pick? Yeah, he picked Brazil. So they're, they're excited for that, but I'll tell you what. Okay. Good luck to Brazil, but I want America to We want Team USA, other. but I don't know. If Brazil set up that sea turtle, they probably just had like a bigger piece of food hanging off yeah. their flag. I'm still just watching for the announcers. Yeah. Went fishing last week and caught a turtle. Wow. I know. Wait, I should say that. Were you supposed to catch Not, not by, you know, I wasn't, I wasn't. I, I was on vacation realize. last week and petted and You are going to say you have a cover photo of a turtle and now you're catching turtles. Not on wow. purpose. I was looking for the big bass. That didn't happen for me. Uh, I let the turtle go. Don't worry. I gave it a little petting and sent it on its way. It, it got a piece of shit out of it. We're tracking a little bit of some showers. Uh, no turtles. You didn't fish with a hook, did you? Oh, well, what do you think you fish with? Bare hands or a net? Yeah, I'm just a jungle woman. I just dive right in. Thanks you for joining us in the Amazon. Right. <laughs>